Hello. Hello. So, Kylan, how, how, would, how do you feel about your upcoming appearance in this new movie? I feel the appearance was good, but they called me at 6 a.m., told me, be down here at 7. I live two hours away. I don't know why they thought I'd be able to get here in time, but you know what? I did it, because I'm a trooper, and I'm committed, and I'm in two roles. I say, so. t t tell me about these two roles, because you, you seem to be have to take on the most work in this movie so far. I do. I am the hardest worker of the group. My two roles, first one is a reprisal of fan favorite Dinkelberg, who I thought meant a very unceremonious end, not the way I would have written it. I think he was clearly the hero of the movie, but no, the writers have to disagree. But Dinkelberg comes back for a small cameo. I'm not going to say how, but he's there. My other character is a newly introduced villain. I would say the best villain in the, you know, franchise. I'd say better than Eli as a villain. John's not really a villain, but, you know, better than John. The best, honestly, because it's me. But his name, I'm not going to tell you his name. You're going to have to watch it to find out because it's that freaking good. Because of me. I, I heard rumors from some of the, some of the crew people that your, your uh, new villain character may be a certain homage to a, to a classic, to a classic movie. It's an homage to a classic movie and a classic cartoon television series. Uh, uh, there are some Arnold Schwarzenegger as Terminator vibes. Am I saying I'm as good as the governor? Yes, I am. There's also some vibes from Thomas the Tank Engine, who... I mean, I'm not a fan, but of him in particular, we have some very specific religious disagreements, but I set those aside for the writers. I really don't like the train culture. It's bad. It needs to end, but whatever. I set it aside for, for the fans. With having to take on those, the two iconic roles at once, did you feel any pressure to stay true to their brands? No. Wow. Okay then. Well, thank you. Thank you for talking with us today. Thank you. You're welcome. You can go back to your ping pong game now. Hey, welcome to Beirut. Population 2.2 million. <laughs>